Hey, yo. hey, what's up? It's Izzy here with I Do The Most, and I'm back with some Yu-Gi-Oh! product opening. And what's this? We got our boy Teddy here hanging out with us and haven't had him on the channel in a while, so he, he's definitely brought us some luck in the past. I'm hoping that trend will continue today, so definitely send some love out to Teddy. But what 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 does he have behind him? What what's what's going on here, buddy? What is this? What you got here? Let me let me just scooch on. Oh, we got the Urshifu V Max Premium Collection. Now, actually, um, my local Walmart had this set and the blue set. So we got the Rapid Strike and the Single Strike boxes to open up. They were both on sale for $20 a box, which is a freaking steal. Of course, I had to hop on that. So I got one of each of those. And I also got a third mystery box that I'll be opening on the channel as well. So if you're excited for this uh, our seafood Single Strike VMAX box opening, and you're excited to see our boy Teddy back on the channel, ask that you leave a like. And without further ado, let's jump straight into it. All right, now I do have this hooked up on my tripod today. I'm starting to like using this because there's a lot of different angles that I can take and record with using the tripod. And I don't need an extra set of hands and I can do it the way that I like. So I'm, I'm feeling this. But anyway, let's see what we got in here. This was lucky number 28. I think this was the box that uh, Bear picked. So I'll let you pick one. And I'll pick one of the other set. That box had something weird in it. What is that? A leaf? The bottom of somebody's shoe. Oh. Give me a second. I'm going to go wash my hands. I don't know what the hell that was. Alright, and we're back at it. I'm going to put Teddy over in the corner, of course, to bring us some luck. We got the Yu-Gi-Oh! Battle Pack mat in the background. I got to get some more mats. Switch it up a little bit. Alright. Alright. So we got our three promo cards. First off, we got the Single Strike Urshifu V. The basic version. We got the, the Single uh, Strike Energy to make the combo work. And lastly, we got the Single Strike Urshifu V Max, the big boy. We actually pulled quite a few of those when we got the, uh, the Battle Styles Booster Box case. Came with like six boxes. It took forever to finish opening those. <laughs> got some nice cards from it though. And then we got the Giant Boy. I'm going to add that to my uh, my Giant Collector's book. Right now I think I'm up to like maybe 12 Giant cards. I mean, unless you're actively searching them. They're a bit difficult to get. Alright. Let's see what kind of packs they gave us in here. Got a, two Battle Styles. Vivid Voltage, Darkness Ablaze, Battle Styles, Vivid Voltage, Darkness Ablaze times two. So what was that? Three of each? Three of each and just one vivid, two vivid voltage. All right. I ain't even noticed that. Got an online code for anybody who plays the TCG online. All right, I think I'm going to just open them in the order that they are. Let's get a little zoom action going. There we go. Maybe back just, just, eh, there we go. Start out with the battle styles. I still haven't gotten the rarest Urshifu VMAX yet, so maybe today that will change. Online code for the TCG players. Four to the front. Starting out with a Grass Energy. Carnivine. Phoebe. Ndidi. Onyx. 
bell sprout. Got a Galarian Mr. Mime, a Silly Cobra, Me and Fu, Mawile Reverse, and Bronzong Holographic. Oh god, I can't tell you how many of those damn Bronzongs I've pulled. Into another Battle Styles. That one actually got the uh, single strike V Max or Sifu as its cover art. Online call. Pack number two. Let's see what it do. Got a fighting energy. Did that bode well for my future? Earn a vitality. Energy recycler. Golbat. Cherubi. Mawile. Onyx. Remoraid, Zubat, Ndidi Reverse, and Conkeldor. It's our rare. I'm going to put that Vivid Voltage last. Change my mind. There's only two of those. And out of all these packs, that's, my, that's the one I'm most excited about opening up Vivid Voltage. I will open the other one whenever it appears, though. There you go. Forward to the front. What is this? Darkness ablaze? Yep, darkness ablaze. <laughs> Alright, we're starting off with a psychic energy. Pupitar. Kabuskin. Struggle gloves. Mr. Mime. Fletching. Fletchling. Talon Flame on Pokemon Unite is freaking broken. Uh, not really. It's not broken, but it's definitely. A Pokemon that you got to be aware of because it can come in and steal your objectives. It can come in and get like kills on you if you're not paying attention or your teammates or your support characters. That way they can run through your it's so freaking. You, you got to keep an eye out for it. If you play Pokemon Unite, you got to keep an eye out for Talonflame. Got Electric, Pan Sage, Skarmory. Poltergeist, Poltygeist, Volcarona, was that it? I thought there was one more. Okay, Volcarona is our rare. I didn't realize Poltygeist was a reverse hollow. Back into battle styles. Pack number four. Totally do. Four to the top. Got a Dark Energy, Fan of Waves, Seedra, Girder. When are they going to put Conkeldor in the game? They got Machamp in there. Now we need someone to combat him. Gliger, Boltoy, Electabuzz, Honech, Tepic, Single Strike Energy, and Galarian Mr. Rhyme. They should let... Mr. Mime Evolve in Pokemon Unite, as well as Pikachu. A big complaint that Pikachu players have in Pokemon Unite is that towards the like late mid game to the end, uh, late game, Pikachu, his power isn't up there with the rest of the Pokemon. He's still very good. As far as like his utility, his moves and stuff. But he's not putting out as much damage as he was earlier in the game. Up to like, say like level 10 and, and before. They let him evolve into Raichu. You know, they'd give him a buff. Even if you had to wait to like level 10, just keep his power pretty much where he's at. Maybe give him a slight debuff in each level. And then when he evolves into Raichu, you get all that power and some. I think that that would make him much better in, in Pokemon Unite. But so far, the way that it is, when I when I have a Pikachu on my team, I usually rock along with him because, you know, even starting out like with Electro Web and stuff, being able to stun them for a few seconds, forcing them to use their eject button or their dash move or whatever the case is prematurely. And then I'm I'm usually maining Venusaur, so I can hit him with my Vine Whip and stun him for another second, and then we just go in and take him out. Or Snorlax you can use the tackle, and that'll mess up their dash move, or you know, all types of different ways you could do it. 
Drum beat, hit my top. We could do some hit lines in there too. Macargo, Beldum, Metagross. Uh, I don't know. I just feel like Beldum would look weird in the game. Other than that, I I wouldn't see. I wouldn't be opposed to Metagross being in there. As you could probably tell, I've been playing a lot of Pokemon Unite. Like I've been obsessed with it. <laughs> I'm up to like, uh, I'm up to ultra three. So I think maybe two more level ups and I'll be in masters. So I'll keep you updated on that as well. We've got Blitzel, Milkery, Skiddo, Eevee, Voltorb Reverse, and a hey, bang. Our first V card. We got an Orbital V with the exception of the, uh, promo cards. All right. All right. Not bad. What set was that? Was that uh that was Vivid Voltage? Okay, that's why I didn't recognize that that monster. I did do like a bulk opening of Vivid Voltage. I think of like fifty two packs or something like that. But uh, other than that, I haven't opened too too much of them. Next up, we got Darkness Ablaze. We got two Darkness Ablaze back to back. The other one got the Charizard on it, but this one feels thick. Are you trying to tell me something, Pokemon? There we go. Online code. I'll put four at the top. Got a fire energy. Billowing smoke. Semi sage. Clang. Skitty. Please, God, don't put Skitty in them in the game. Clink. Grimer. Mr. Mime. Electrike. Purloin reverse and bang! Hey, we got ourselves a Salamence VMAX. Super dope. So this is actually the first one of these that I've gotten. So back-to-back -back hits. I am not even mad. Go Walmart. Sometimes I feel like Walmart be beating me over my head. But today they, they seem like they came through. My boy Teddy getting close. So you know what that means. I mean, it's clutch time. We got two packs left. One Darkness Ablaze and a Vivid Voltage. This one feels a little heavy, too. Maybe it's just me. Maybe I just want it to feel heavy. Go. Four. Fire Energy. Turbo Patch. What's that? Flip a coin. If heads attach a basic energy from your discard pile to one of your Pokemon that... Isn't a Pokemon GX. Okay, so it's basically a potential to get an extra energy. Not, not bad. Kabu. Gotharita. Panpour. Diglett. Jigglypuff. Rowlet. I'm just saying. Cubchoo. Escavalier. Look at that artwork, dog. Imagine him in Pokemon Unite. He'd look badass just like jousting with his lances. <laughs> and lastly, we got a muck. Look like that card then went a muck. <laughs> Alright, our last pack is Vivid Voltage. Please give me that thick Pikachu. Oh, please. Would you be so kind as to give me the thick cheeks. Online code. I'm still confused at how these things can be scanned. And from your phone and stuff like that. Like, is it because it's arranged a certain way? Okay, I do see slight differences. But even then, like, so could any... Um, black and white, like square based images that is similar enough to that be scanned in the same way that those are. I don't know. Technology confuses me sometimes. We got a dark energy, Allister, Cramorant. He's in there. I, I don't think he's good personally. I know that there's a lot of Cramorant mains or Cramorant lovers in the game, but. You know, I love Garchomp as a Pokemon, but he's he's just not good on there. 
he's not good unless the player is exceedingly good. I got Nessa, Beldum, Fampy, who Don Fan would be good. Dusko, Electric, Pineco, Winden Stadium, and lastly, a Garbador garbage. <laughs> so, you know, you win some, you lose some. We got two nice pulls, Salamence, VMAX, Orbital V, and the uh, two single strike Urshifus. So I can't be too mad about that, you know. Plus the giant card, that's probably the big one for me. I like collecting the cooler uh, giant cards. So if you enjoyed the video, if you're still rocking with me up to this point, I'd like to say thank you. Please like and share the video to others who enjoy Pokemon and Yu-Gi-Oh! pack opening videos. We definitely have a bunch of those on the channel. It helps the channel out a bunch, and it's much appreciated. We're growing slowly but we're getting there and i'm appreciating all the support that and all the love that people are showing but with that being said i'm going to head out you have yourself a good day peace